It's an incredible uh, opportunity for uh, uh, a sportsman like me who is, you know, uh, from an offbeat background to sort of make inroads into what might be the next big milestone in, in triathlon. So I really would like to thank uh, GMR Sport for, you know, demonstrating incredible leadership in picking offbeat athletes like ourselves. Uh, the Olympic distance triathlon is about a 1.5 kilometer swim, 40 kilometers on the bike and 10 kilometers on the run. A half Ironman is a 1.9 kilometer swim, uh, 90 kilometers on the bike and 21 on the run and an Ironman is, which is my uh, primary sport it's a 3.8 kilometer swim um, 180 kilometer bike ride and then a 42 kilometer run an entire marathon at the end and you have a person like me it's living life on the offensive because I believe that uh, people uh, that are you know somewhat out of the spotlight definitely have to uh, master the courage to go after their dreams because it seems so far away most of the time and it seems like we are standing against a peak that we can't surmount occasionally and I think true daredevilry to me is the never say die attitude where you're you know you're really not phased by anything you hear and it's in, in you know it is completely intuitive whatever you do is completely intuitive and I think that is what defines daredevilry for me. So every lady that walks outside when I run in the mornings or every mother that you know in her sari and her kids is outside at uh, six in the morning you know knowing fully well that she has to go back into the kitchen and get her husband and kids ready for the day I mean they are my heroes because I believe that you know true heroism or true daredevilry is really coming from people who have chosen to live their life a certain way you know and I think that um, uh, you know, people use words like ordinary, but I think that it is in fact uh, quite the opposite. You know, as an Indian, I feel that I've had the privilege of having lived in so many different places, but I was definitely born here and so was my husband. And, you know, we, we see it as a, as a very special place for more reasons than just being born here, you know. And, and uh, so, I, you know, to answer your question, yes, I, I do believe uh, it is some sort of homecoming and, and I've, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm very thrilled, I'm very thrilled. So. Oh, my God.